sorry. How can I make it up to you? Well, I don't know. You tell me. Would this be enough? What's this? Well, it's been several years now, and it's time for you for a new phone with 20% more data from the Docomo Pacific. You know what's more better than more data? More friends. And you know what else? More love. Hi, my name is Brian Munia. I'm a local filmmaker. We're going to surprise my uh, girlfriend of five years, Marissa, and today I will ask her to marry me. We're setting up a mock commercial shoot. We had a lot of our friends involved to play the extras on the set. Two of our other friends that were playing the actors. We came up with this, this amazing script. What's this? Well, it's been several years now, and it's time for you for a new phone. <laughs> Marissa has actually helped me on a couple of shoots. And I asked her, since she had a camera, if she could just get behind the scenes footage of me in action just to get her on the set. She was excited about it. And I actually thought she might have suspected things, but then, you know. <laughs> so as I'm talking to the actors and trying to play along, I'm also trying to think I better make sure that I'm ready when the time comes. I'm sorry. How can I make it up to you? Well, I don't know. You tell me. Would this be enough? What's this? We needed to find a way to replace Ted and Dez in the same scene with Marissa and I. Ted was already struggling, naturally, <laughs> with his lines. So the thing that I had to do was try to direct Ted in his acting. So what I would do is I would go to Ted and say, all right, Ted, let me go ahead and model what I want you to do. That way, I'm now in Ted's position. Now to bring Marissa to, to Desiree's position, which would be right in front of me, Desiree would say, I need a restroom break. Need the restroom? Yeah. First time. And I would say, oh, uh, Marissa, can you um, stand in for Des? And let's go run through these lines so we can show Ted how to, to play through the scene. And that was the perfect moment. There's a lot to think about <laughs> before you ask that question. And I walk in. Oh, you're late. I'm sorry, I'm, I'm sorry. How can I make it up to you? I don't know, you tell me. Would this be enough? Oh, that, that, that's not a cell phone. <laughs> it's not. <laughs> but, you know, I wanted to... Uh, we've been together for a little over five years. And... This is so hard because I'm trying not to uh, stumble, but... Do you remember our first kiss? Yes. And what was our first kiss? Where? Yeah, where was it? It was on set. It was on set. Yeah. And we're on set right now. And uh, I've grown a lot with you. And um, you make me happy. And I like to think that I make you happy too. And we have a beautiful sun together. And the things that I live for, 
the things that matter to me are hearing the two of you laugh. And I'm still happy that after all this time, I could still make you laugh just as hard as the first time we met. But I just wanted to tell you that my intentions for you were always this, that I always wanted to get to this moment with you because I love you. I love you and it's, it's that simple. And you and Nolan mean so much to me. So with that said, I just wanted to say, Marissa, Will you marry me? Yes. My name is Brian Munia, and this is my now fiance, Marissa. I love you. I love you. <laughs> <laughs>